Hello, brothers and sisters in Christ. I just got to play this for you. You just won't believe it. Today is Friday, April the 10th. It's 9.05. I think I clicked on a link from emails for how I got here. But anyway, this is a channel I don't believe I've ever heard. Grind All 61. Listen to this. It starts at the 4 minute 26 second mark. Uh, the title is America Has Died. New America, spelled with a K, is here. It happened overnight without your consent. On social distancing, but as 9 and 10's Bill Freilich reports, not every call is an emergency. He continues our team coronavirus coverage. 911 centers are busy taking calls, but not for the usual reasons. That even happens with small groups. Take this report of a crew working on a lawn for the second day in a row. It turned out to be a brother and sister working in the yard. Ridiculous. A crew working on a yard. It's a brother and a sister. Oh my goodness. Yeah, it's Sunday and the Brighton police are apparently arresting a dad for throwing a ball to his daughter in complete isolation in a park of about, I don't know, 30, 40 it's acres. Huge. It looks like but a big farm. Apparently that is not allowed by Brighton. According to our police, he's not allowed to do it. Meanwhile, face coverings while out in public are now mandatory in Riverside County. And residents who don't comply could face a hefty fine. CBS 2's Candace Crown reports from Riverside with more on the new order. Did you catch that? I'll play it again. Mandatory in Riverside County, and residents who don't comply could face a hefty fine. CBS 2's Candace Crown reports from Riverside with more on the new order. The new order. She wasn't told to say world order, but it is the new order. The county is really stepping up its efforts to slow the spread of the coronavirus by fining people who leave their home without wearing a mask. And the fine for violating the order is $1,000 per day per violation. $1,000. And the reporter has on a mask. This kills me. I mean, I don't know whether to laugh or cry. But I'll leave a link if y'all care to watch the rest of that. Oh, it's getting into one called Beaches Still Crowded. Gee, I wonder what they're going to do. Let's hear it. Weather and some good surf. Many people left their house today to go to the beach. Here's what Sandy Beach Park looked like earlier this afternoon. Now, beach parks across the state remain closed, and while you can conduct ocean acti activities in the ocean and work out on a beach if you'd like, things like sunbathing can get you in trouble. And as Nikki Shenfeld finds out, some police officers aren't giving out warnings anymore. Oh my goodness. Some people are still confused about what is and what is not allowed at the beach. People are still coming out to enjoy it, and those that are are having to pay a hefty price. More and more people are now getting cited for hanging out at the beach. On Maui, office. Oh my gosh. Yeah, those two girls are sitting way too close together. And there are police writing tickets. Those two people are sitting way too close together. But everybody else seems to be at least six feet apart. But I guess if you allow them, more will come. Beaches will be crowded again and where will be the social distancing they want us to have so now they gotta write tickets i was waiting to see if they arrested officers anybody. issuing citations to people laying out at napili bay mpd also sharing this photo of officers getting ready to let beachgoers know they have to go Police statewide said they spent the last week warning people of the new rules. Once your feet touch the sand, you must be exercising, walking or running, or walking towards the ocean for an ocean activity like surfing. What's not allowed oh, is sunbathing. Now, wait a minute. Those three guys on surfboards were not six feet apart. Y'all are, are 
uh, confusing everybody by what's allowed and what's not allowed. You're not making sense. You see how stupid that is? You gotta watch this. You're allowed to run toward the water and get in the water. And you can do an ocean activity like these three guys fixing to surf. And they're paddling their surfboards and they're like this close together, you know. Maybe a foot. Okay, maybe two even. Disgusting. It's just gotten crazy ridiculous. Okay, I'm just going to end this here. I'll leave the link if you want to watch it. Okay, bye for now. It's a total of almost 12 minutes. Have a good day. God bless you all. Oh, and I've been forgetting to say, remember this, no weapon formed against us shall prosper. Keep saying your Psalm 91 every night over your family, your household, whatever, and mean it. Okay, bye for now. I'll talk to you later.